Today is part of a celebration, <laughs> a celebration to an activity that started in 2019. And today we are continuing with the celebration of Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving for another milestone, another first for Grenada. This evening that brings us together in the Isle of Spice, Grenada, signifies a collective commitment of more than 72 experts of multiple disciplines to understanding the biodiversity and ecosystem services that define Grenada's beauty, diversity, and its, and its culture. We are very pleased that the Grenada National Ecosystem Assessment will be launched this afternoon. The assessment provides us with a comprehensive understanding of the health of Grenada's ecosystems and their services and the critical linkages between them and human well-being. What that assessment report does is that it presents information on the current status and threats to key ecosystems here in Grenada. So these ecosystem types range from coastal, marine, terrestrial, agricultural ecosystems, and there's a very strong focus on genetic resources, for instance. And it further strengthens the foundation for evidence-based policies that foster a balance between human activities, the conservation of the country's natural capital, and the prosperity of its citizens. The OECS Commission is dedicated to the social and economic development of independent and non-independent countries in the Eastern Caribbean. Grenada's National Ecosystem Assessment is a testament to what we can achieve when we work collaboratively through an open, inclusive, credible, and transparent process and to fully consider their value in shaping a sustainable future for nature and for people. To ensure a better quality of life for the people in the OECS.